Hello everyone, you are watching my YouTube channel Chemistry by Sadhanavar and today we are going to discuss one of the harder, one of the past paper question. The question is, this is the reaction which you guys can see here at screen. What we have to do with this reaction, we have to find the order of this reaction. But how to find the order of this reaction, the data is given here. You can see guys, the data is given here. I will play with with this data and determines the order with respect to NO and with respect to CO. So let's see how to find the order of this reaction by playing with these values. Guys, I have to find the order of reaction with respect to NO. So you have to choose these two values. Let's say you're going to choose one and two. Okay, you're going to choose one and two. Here you have to compare initial rates like this. So you guys can see here in experiment number two, the quantity, the concentration of NO is double. You guys can see in experiment number two, when you compare experiment number one and experiment, experiment number two, the quantity of NO is double. Okay, okay guys, now let's compare the initial rates. So for comparison of initial rate, the easiest way is divide these two. Use your own calculator, guys, and divide these two. Let me divide first as well. So when I divide like 7.40 into 10 raised to power minus 4 upon 1.85 into 10 raised to power minus 4, you will see I will be getting answer 4. So guys, remember, when you make the concentration double and initial rate, a rate of reaction will be square of it. Like square of two is four. Then this is always a second order reaction. This is always a second order reaction. Maybe this this one of this point does not make sense to you. Let me show you one of the book statement. Just focus on the just focus on this. What I'm highlighting now. Second order. Whatever you do to the concentration, the rate changes by the same factor squared. Again, see, whatever you do, the concentration, the rate changes by the same factor squared. Similarly, for first order, whatever you do, the concentration, the rate changes by same factor. In a second order, whatever you do, the concentration, the rate changes by same factor squared. Note down this, guys. Note down this point. So here, you see when the concentration of NO is double, like when the concentra when you compare these two and the concentration of NO is double, you guys can see rate is four times. You guys can see by this comparison, rate is four times. Four means square of concentration, like square of this. So, so this is a second order reaction. So I would say, Order of this reaction is second. Sec this is the second order reaction with respect to NO. Now there is another way to solve it, and this is a like kind of kind of mathematical way. I will I gonna say. So I gonna compare these two values again. So rate one upon rate two. This is rate one. This is rate two. Rate constant rate constant so here i put concentration and its order is let's say x concentration of other its order is y concentration is order is x concentration of co its order is y so rate one is rate one is um, 1.85 into 10 raised to the power minus 4, 7.40 into 10 raised to the power minus 4. So concentration 2.75 into 10 raised to the power minus 4, 2 points, uh, sorry, it's not 2 point. It's 5.50 into 10 raised to the power minus 4. Well, guys, this would be the same. So, so you do not need to put these two because both are same. So you can cancel out this. So you do not need to put values because both are same. So you can cancel out this. 
it would be so when you solve this you will be getting one upon four you know solve this use calculator and solve this 2.75 10 to the power minus 4 over 5.50 10 to the power minus 4 so you will be getting 1 upon 2 1 upon 4 is equals to 1 upon 2 for simplicity just take a reciprocal like that just invert this 4 is equals to 2 so guys you can see or you can say 2 raised to power 2 so you guys you can see whatever you do with concentration rate is square of it rate is square of it so this is a second order reaction with respect to and no so x is 2 like x is the order of reaction so x is 2 now we have to find the order of reaction with respect to cu x is 2 like x is the order of reaction with respect to no again same procedure i will compare now let's say 1 and 3 it's your choice you can compare 2 and 3 as well so rate rate 1 over rate 3 k upon k so n o x into c o y n o x into c o y so rate 1 is 1.85 into 10 to power minus 4 um, seven uh, not not seven this is 1.18 into 10 raised to power minus 2 and o is 2.75 into 10 raised to power minus 4 you guys can see here and o is 1.10 its concentration is this you guys can see here x value is 2 co 7.25 into 10 raised to power minus 4 2.90 into 10 raised to power minus 3 it's y so guys when you solve this you need calculator use your own calculator guys i am doing with my calculator calculator makes jobs easy so what i am getting is when you solve this i'm getting 1 over 64 so solve this like you have to solve this entire equation just put this as such in calculator it would take time so don't get panic just put as this in calculator one two three i'm just trying to make it quickly so i'm afraid if i can do mistake 7.25 no i cannot do mistake So, guys, when you solve it, interestingly, you will get 1 upon 64 raised to power, raised to power y. So, you see, when bases are same, like this is base, this is base, or 1 upon 64 is equals to 1 upon 64, or you can say 64 is equals to 64, if I am not wrong in mathematics. So, when bases are same, then power is equals to power power becomes equal to each other so y is one so with respect to ca the order of this reaction is one